The Securities and Exchange Commission says it will this week issue new capital requirements and guidelines for market players. Now, before we come to that, let's uh, take this other story. The National Insurance Commission, in collaboration with the police, has again blown the lid off another unlicensed insurance brokerage firm operating under the name Family Founding Insurance Brokers. This company, according to the NIC, has been operating for some time now as an intermediary with the support of a direct underwriting company. My colleague Bismarck Usa has more on the following report. According to the NIC, the suspects whose techniques are perpetrated at the premises of the Ayalolo Transport Terminal in Accra Central have been serving as an intermediary between the unsuspecting insurance public and a known licensed underwriting insurance company. They are currently under police investigations and if found culpable would face criminal prosecution according to law. The discreet approach employed by the Special Investigative Unit of the NIC and the police on September 9, 2020 led to the suspects unknowingly disclosing their mode of operations after weeks of surveillance and trailing. Armed with conspicuous information, the suspects were picked up by the police. The Deputy Commissioner of Insurance, Michael Ando, had this to say. Well, the National Insurance Commission has an, um, um, a monitoring unit that surveys the market and, and monitors these development. And so um, that unit um, has been um, scanning the environment and making sure that we have only licensed entities to sell genuine insurance products to the market. This is the work of this unit that um, led to the uncovering of, of this unlicensed insurance brokerage. Mr. Ando also indicated that Illegal sale of insurance in the country could lead to locked up premiums and also non-payment of claims. This could lead to a whole lot of problems. This could lead to mis-selling. This could lead to um, um, selling for uh, companies that don't exist. This could even lead to defrauding the public because these are unlicensed people and only heaven knows what kind of insurance companies and what kind of entities they are operating for. So this has very serious consequences for everybody, including the insur insuring public. The NIC says it will investigate the underwriting company involved and would apply the relevant sanctions as stipulated under the Insurance Act 2006 Act 724 of the National Insurance Commission, which makes it a crime to engage any unlicensed insurance intermediary. The Commission is therefore advising the general public to report the activities of any nefarious and suspicious character or company trading or soliciting for insurance business without due authorization to either the police or the nearest NIC office.